Warning, this is not a how-to, step-by-step, or instructional channel. We are not professionals. Everything you see is real and not rehearsed. Following our instructions may result in you redoing the job over. Enjoy. Okay, redo. We are headed to Manchester, 45 minutes away from our house, to look at my new work vehicle, a 2002 Ford Focus wagon. Um, my Nelly, which is my V8 all-wheel drive Jeep Grand Cherokee, is too expensive to be my, my daily everywhere driver. Unfortunately, it's just using too much gas. Um, for me to do what I'm doing so we are using that for everything else and my driving to people around everywhere car is going to be this focus so we will take a look and make sure it's what we're paying for we're paying about five hundred dollars so Obviously, it's not going to be, you know, a new Porsche or anything, but she's going to be perfect. I know it because we're going to make her perfect or as perfect as we can because that's what we do at Junkers. So, okay, stay tuned and we will see you in Manchester. That's called oh, junk, Junker Clunkers, right? Yes. Is right, that? So Junker Clunkers, family and people, community Junkers he Clunkers, um, you know, right uh, followers. <laughs> this is a really sweet 2002 Ford Focus, but it's going to be so much sweeter when Junker Clunkers is finished with it. Amen. Just stay tuned. Yes, yeah, stay ready. tuned. Like, to share, and subscribe. Away. <laughs> so this, so our friend, our new friends, Hi, Our new friend Sean here. This is Sean. Nice to meet everybody. And his Heather. mom, Heather. She didn't want to be recorded, but we're gonna so we're gonna be respectful, but hear my voice. So we'll add her voice. We're near an airport, so we got some some big birds. But yeah, so we came across this 2002, as Sean said, Ford Focus. S-E. S-E wagon. <laughs> Um, so they took immaculate care of this this it's hard to see at night I have the little light but they this thing is in immaculate condition it's got very very little body damage and I mean for a 2002 the wear and tear is like very minimal and apparently these people are very clean look at how well, they took care of the inside. Oops, what did I just do? This is how it looks on a bad day. Yes. The, so, I, haven't it in like a month. I don't mean these people. I haven't cleaned it in a month. Yeah. <laughs> so, apparently, this is their version of dirty. I guess Sean and Heather are very, very clean people, which um, we can definitely attest to that. They have this, a nice apartment. They have a nice yeah. apartment. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I wish I had that motivation in life, maybe, but it, it like the care of this. The you got the rocker panels here that are in very good shape. Oops, just turn the light off. When I stick my hand underneath, there's no crunching, no crunchy crispies, if you guys know what I mean. No Captain no Crunch. Flakes. No flakes. No Captain Crunches. So of course we got Bob. Hi, Bob. Hi. And um, he's testing out the passenger seat. <laughs> so this is going to be my work vehicle. Um, as you guys know, I work for an agency where I do a day program with people <laughs> with special needs. So we needed something that was reliable and comfortable and had plenty of room for people that needed extra room. So it's easy to get in and out of. And this is going to be perfect it's got the trunk space alone is um you oh i gotta hit the button so there this oh yeah yeah so there's a button here look at this this whole i mean everything is just so nice in here 
It's got a CD player. Configurations are in order. It's got a, you can put your, play your, play your, play, what's that, your playlist your with the... I tried arts. to get her to throw oh, in yeah. a, oh, I tried to get, I tried to get her to throw in a pink CD because I thought maybe, you know. There you go. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I could have left them. I didn't know who, like, you know. Yeah. So we could things. go down the road singing. <laughs> yeah. Well, what's the song that she sings? Oh, she sings a lot of them. I was going to say one of them, I, I, but it's I not YouTube appropriate. Uh, she sings... As long as you don't play it, we're okay. So, I, I'm very excited to drive this, and I think that uh, Junker Clunker's mom is going to be a little jealous because... Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think she saw the picture, and she already wants it. She wants to trade, so I'm going to have to tell her now. So... This is this is gonna be my baby. Not so. today. Not today. <laughs> now we just gotta come up with a name for her. The Jeep's name is Nelly. I don't know what to name this one yet, but she <laughs> definitely connects with me. There's definitely a there's definitely a connection. So I feel like this is the right one for me. So you can't you can't ignore those feelings. So, but yeah. So stay right. tuned. Yep. Welcome back to Junker Clunkers. I am Grady, your host as normal. We have Brittany, the woman, slash technician, and we have Blue. Uh, so, in this video, we're buying a economical car for Brittany. She drives way too many miles to be riding that Jeep. It's a 5.7 Hemi. $170 worth of gas one week, guys. We can't have that. Can't have that at all. So, Brittany and Bob, they're gonna head down to Manchester, uh, New Hampshire, and uh, we found a what looks to be a pretty good rig. So let's get into that. Yep. You got anything to say? Um, gonna miss driving my Jeep every day, but at least I have it for recreation winter. and winter and. Oh, hey guys! By the way, this is not a sponsor. Uh, this is not a sponsorship or anything like that. This is a review. So in this video, we're also going to be using uh, this Odelphi headlamp uh, light. So we're going to give you some details on that. Check it out, see if it's worth getting. So come along for the ride. And then we have Brent. Hi. <laughs> yes. Cold start, it's been sitting here about a week. Oh, ha ha. See is just great. Just great. And running over rocks. Well, that wasn't my fault. What? I couldn't. How the hell am I gonna see that? Because you're super. How in the hell am I gonna see that? Because you're super junkers. Yeah. I'm a super junkie. Super junkie. It's getting cold up here in the north. It is. Especially with no heat in the shop. We fall, folks. This is. Yeah, give her a walk around. 
So she's got very, very minimal damage. So it's a 2002 with what, 104,000 on it? Not even 102. That was a lot of damage here. Yeah, there's a big. dent over here. But, I mean, a dent here and there is. Let's get it up on the lift. We'll bring you guys back in a second. Yay. I don't think it's going anywhere. You gotta pan back a little bit, bro. All right, so we're just gonna do some quick checks on some things. Transmission fluid is there. This thing's got the Z Tech. I don't know what the hell that means, but it's got it. He said this was like the sporty focus. Oil's like right up there to the full mark. It looks like it was recently changed. It's got a newer battery in it. I know it's got some newer tires on it. You come over here, Brett. Oh, it's got a newer hole, coolant hose on it too. Uh, power steering pump, bit the dust. As you can see, there's, there's nothing there. There's no pulley. So we're gonna, we already ordered one because we knew we needed it no matter what. Ew, cooling is gross. Give me a shot of that. Look at this light, guys. This thing's awesome. Yeah, it's murky. Very gross. What's that mean? So they probably they probably mixed it with something at some point in time. Oh, okay. So we're gonna need a serpentine belt also. Uh, strut towers are in great shape. There's no rot there. It looks like there's been newer struts been put on it at some point in time. Yeah, they said they did put newer them. headlights, as you can see. TYC, those are eBay specials, if I'm not oh, wow. I'm not correct. They really did take really good care of this car, huh? Let's let's hope. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go up. See, this is where the damage is. We'll we'll fix that the best we can. Probably this summer we'll put a uh, a new new hood on it, paint it. Maybe we'll get her one of those hood scoops. Oh yeah. We're not getting you a hood scoop. Yeah. Why? That would be awesome. I feel like pimp my rod. Junker Pippin. Junker Pippin. <laughs> Junker So this is the same color, I believe, as my, my truck. Got a little bit of a crack here, huh? Yeah. That's nothing. I mean, this is a, <clears throat> this is a winter rig. That's, that's the only reason we bought it. It's a what? Winter rig. I want to check the back, just make sure I'm not going to hit anything. Isn't it just a work rig? Yeah, it's a work, a work winter rig. Oh. That's what? the main reason, I mean. Yeah, but isn't it gonna be a summer rig too? Probably. How's it looking? Huh? I don't know. It looks like it's supported. No. Am I gonna hit anything? No. Go on your word. Uh, stop. Why? Because there's a bag up there. Yeah, with the bag will move. Okay. Well, then you're all good. Keep going, I guess. Tell me. Yeah. How we looking? Still can go up more. I'm gonna go to the next click. Okay. Okay, come on up here. I got no play up and down. These tires look like they're in decent shape here. Oh my goodness. Ball joints, uh, the boot is ripped, but it hasn't had any play yet. These are fairly cheap to replace. And I've, I've got them offline before. Are those replaced? So. Do they need to be replaced right now? No, they're okay with this minute. Just checking here. Yeah, all these pulleys are good. Wow. AC still spins, so. There's really not a lot of, I don't see a lot of. This is a little crusty. No, nah, that's nothing. It's not rotted or anything, so. What's this? Why is uh, this? Power steering pump's got some, or uh, not pump, sorry. The uh, rack and pinion's got some uh, some grossness coming off it. So we might have a leak there. What's that? What's the rack and pinion? For? It's what makes your steering steer. Or that could be blowing back from the transmission pan seal. We'll have to get a new seal and replace the filter and such on that at some point in time. I don't see any rot as far as 
in the subframe or anything. It all looks pretty solid. Wow. The inner rockers look okay on the front side there. Inner rockers look really good over here. So they usually... Is... Come on. Come back here. They usually rot really bad in here. And this is in really good shape, guys. Um, So far to me... Why is this wet? I just told you the pan seals like that. Why is there a hole in this? What? Oh, never mind. It's not a hole. Not a hole, my dear. Okay. Okay. Hold Edit on. that out. So, to me, so far, this thing is uh, is more than worth it. No play there. Yeah, everything looks pretty pretty clean so far. They told me that it passed inspection wow. last year. This is just absolutely amazing. For a... Ooh. I don't like that, but... What? Well, we're not quite on the list like one. What don't you like? Just don't rock it. This car, come over here. This car is in really good shape. There's no rot on the cave on the subframe. This bumper structure's got a little bit. That's what we've had to fix. Come back here. We've had to fix this on mom's before, but this isn't super bad. It does have a hole, but it's not like it's rotting or rotted rotted. Heat shield is ready to come down. We know we need to work on the exhaust. We show the exhaust. The front piece. Front right. Disconnected up there. If we can work on that, no big deal. So back side of the rocker panel is good. We do have some rot on the outside. Just the outs outer rocker. We can get a replacement piece that goes here, goes still right about here, yeah. and that's about where the rot stops. That's perfect. So that's like 35 bucks on eBay. <laughs> this thing is, <laughs> Holy this Lord. is in really good shape. Like I said, there is there is some rot on the the rear support here, but I have I rebuilt these, and this one's actually in pretty good shape. All I have to do is just patch this one. See the rot right here? Oh yeah, yeah. But that's what that's what I've had to do to moms. Holy moly. On both of them, so. This is uh this is in very good shape. Very good shape. She's beautiful. The name of this one is the Hocus Focus. Hocus Focus, of course it is. Of course it is. The Jeep is Nelly, and this one's Hocus Focus. Alright, so I'm gonna take this off so you don't get glare. This is in way better shape than I ever could imagine. Like this is the best focus that I've personally bought so far. Um, so we're definitely gonna put the time and money into this. We'll order up the rocker panel piece. Um, I think what we're gonna do to begin with is just do the uh, the power steering pump, which we we know we need to do. That way, Brittany can. Uh, can drive us possibly on our birthday friday the 16th <gasps> everybody make sure to go on our facebook or <laughs> or the website or whatever and just say happy birthday to Brittany. yay what are you gonna be 23 i wish yeah right. 23 so that's what we're gonna do <laughs> i don't know if we're gonna record it maybe we will if it's something you guys want to see just put it down in the comments and uh and we will but i've noticed that focuses don't really do very good in the videos so we just wanted to bring you along and show you just a little bit of uh, maybe some backstories and stuff like that because the poll revealed that people want to see more of our life. So Oh, they do? Yep, 74% said Isn't they want to see. But this is part of our life. This is part of our lives. But like I said, the videos before don't, don't do very good like with mom's car. I know it's a focus. I know it's boring. There's nothing special about it, really. It's just a daily rig for, for her and, and what have you. And, it's really snowing out there, guys. Show them that. Show them the snow. I'm going to put this down. 
Wow. Show them without dying, bro. <laughs> Look at that. I thought it wasn't supposed to snow till Thursday. This is a surprise storm. To squall. To squall. Hopefully. Okay, so if you guys want to see the magic of the Hocus Focus. Yeah, uh, make sure you go down in the comment section. Yeah. Show them the interior. Okay, Once so. Once again, it's a 2002. <laughs> yeah. And it looks like this. You want the head laugh? All right, guys, that's going to do it for the uh, the end of this video here. Hopefully you enjoyed the content. Uh, I know it's not the best quality in the world, but, you know, we're, we're trying to, to appease to you guys, and we're trying to listen, and you said you wanted to see a little more of, uh, of our life, and, well, this was part of our life, and here you go. But uh, make sure that everybody's uh, going to like, share, and subscribe as normal. Uh, throw some comments down in the comment section. We love to see everybody's comments. And uh, make sure you go on and say happy birthday to Brittany on uh, on Friday the 16th of December here. And anything else, you know, leave it in the comment section. Reach out. Junker Clunkers at Yahoo. All the platforms are all Junker Clunkers with a Z. We'll catch you guys in the next one.